Hey YouTube, what's up? This is Puck Darlington. Today we're gonna update the Arca 7, the V2, because uh, I still have it running the original firmware. Because I had two of these uh, V2s, I sold one with the updated firmware. But now um, I'm gonna update uh, this uh, tablet with uh, the updated firmware, the custom firmware. Uh, that is uh, also spreaded by arctablet.com so you should check out that site arctablets.com and uh, up there uh, you can also find if you search real good uh, you will find the Erka Android uh, flash tool special for the V2 so this is another V1 we're gonna flash the V2 so I just downloaded this program so let's take a look and jump into the computer Welcome back. Okay, what we need to do now is uh, to find the right USB cable and you can see it has a little different uh, plug than the original mini USB. Uh, I can show it to you. I have a mini USB cable here. And you can see that you should not try to fit the original or the standard USB uh, mini USB cable into it because it won't work eh? as you can see this one oops, this one is from the Arcus and this is the standard and you can see the one from the Arcus is slightly thinner and it also looks a little bigger see that but it's thinner you can recognize it Office because it's much thinner than than the original. Okay, um, so what we're gonna do first now? That's really really important. Uh, you need a pin. First we're gonna connect the USB cable here. So you need a pin. Why do you need a pin? Well, I will show it to you because here at the back, you can see it. But here at the back. There must be a reset button. Yeah, you see that little uh, tiny hole there? Yeah. So what we're gonna do, first of all, we're gonna slide it on hold. At the back I showed you the reset button and we're gonna press that reset button for 15 seconds. There we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Okay, so it's on hold, nothing's happening. You see, we press the reset, it's on hold, so nothing's gonna happen. Okay, what we do now, we're gonna uh, stick in the USB cable. Here, see that? And now the computer will say new hardware found. You see that? Okay. Let's go to this step here. Wait, let me turn off my icons because you people will be like so many icons. Okay, here it will ask for a driver. And uh, we say no, not at this time. I'm on the XP install from specific location. And then we go to uh, the, the place where you have uh, the, um, what do you call it, uh, the, the driver, the firmware for um, the Arcus, you know, um, the Erka Android, the Erka Android driver, let me see where it is, I have it on my desktop, I called it Erka Android version Argos V2. So it should be somewhere here. Eka Android, you see you go to the folder. Can you read that people? You go to the folder of the Eka Android. You see, and up here you will have a folder called driver. And then you need a 281 86 XP driver. And then and then you just hit next and let's see if we had the right driver it will look for the USB device and it could be that I 
choose for the wrong driver, but I don't think so. This is the first time I'm doing this, eh? So, mistakes are included in this, uh, in this tutorial. There you go. You see? I selected the right driver. And now, we quit. We say finish. And then I will let my icons show again. And then we go to the folder where you have the RK Android. And then we're gonna start up this program. And you will see, you will see that device upgrade area 1 is green. So um, we're gonna select here. Okay, I have to uh, unpack this first. And then I will put the update image in the RK Android folder. I'm unpacking now, eh? I hope you can see what I'm doing. I'm unpacking now. I'm unpacking everything now. And I just put the updated file in the RK Android folder. So I will go to the RK Android folder now. Should be here, Erka Android, and here's the update. I just hit update, and then you see that uh, on top here, I was trying to do something, scroll for something there on top. But um, when you uh, select the the image, then that all will be um, selected and filled in. So what we're gonna do now? We're gonna hit upgrade. Okay. We're gonna hit upgrade up here because I don't know what I should what I should uh, hit. I think I should hit upgrade. All right, so we hit upgrade, and as you can see, the process is starting. Starting down image to flash. Sorry for the little stripes in the view. I'm recording with the with the cam. As you can see here, down at the at the bottom, it says. 51, 55, 60% device upgrade area. And this is the first time I'm using this batch upgrade V1.23. Eh? This is Arca 2818 batch upgrade. Um, the V, here yeah, you can read it. And it's really hard to find, eh? you, you don't find this software on Google just like that. You have to search really good. And you can see it's it's continuing the process. What exactly is happening now? Well, it's flashing, it's flashing the device. And you can see um, okay. Uh, end one okay null fail. Uh, whatever that means. Um, I think uh, upgrade end 1 is ok, null is fail and I think it's 1 failure 0 up here in the corner you can uh, also read some little uh, information up here you can see two little numbers they will tell you uh, how it went and up here you can see success one failure zero so that means this thing is flash and we're gonna turn on the device one two three four five should turn on there you go Arcus and the difference with uh, flashing this way is that um, you get a much better uh, a much better result as you can see here it will um, it will finish the upgrade. I hope you can all see it a little bit. And your computer, because it's uh, still connected to the USB, you can remove this cable. You see that? I just removed it and just let it do the do. So the computer won't ask for a driver again. We just uh, upgraded this uh, device and we did it the way uh, Arcos would also do it eh? we did it the way it should be done and um, the consumer way is just to uh, copy the file to the root of your device but I'm not uh, really happy with uh, that method because in some way 
um, the device get errors in some way uh, music will stop playing after 30 minutes I had that with a V1 and then I flashed uh, the V1 after that with the RK Android 1.2 that is the previous version of this uh, flashing tool and then uh, everything was fine eh? no more failures no more uh, driver loss at, uh, when playing music after 30 minutes so this was really cool it's still busy it's still uh, formatting the data as you can see oh man this I see smoke coming out of my is that smoke whoa you see that <laughs> just playing around just blowing some smoke up in the thing <laughs> so this takes a while but I'm showing you the complete process cause I can upload long videos to YouTube so you know I don't have to be like it has to be done in 10 minutes or in 15 minutes And if something goes wrong now, and the whole uh, thing uh, has to be done once more, yeah? you can always fix uh, this device with the flashing tool. If you don't have the flashing tool, tool, and this happens to you, let's say you get the error and the thing won't uh, do anything anymore, then you cannot fix it. Eh? You can only fix this device with the flashing tool. So if you flash it, use the flashing tool. I will also. Uh, show you where you can download this flashing tool you can do that at arctablet.com and arctablet.com is giving you so much information about tablet uh, devices and you really get smart up there very friendly admins I uh, requested uh, this tool uh, a while ago I think it was April this year and uh, yeah the link was still there and the admin uh, uh, of uh, Arc Tablet I want to say to you a hey, big up to you our previous site was uh, blown away by some jealous girlfriend so our previous videos the links of our previous videos they all you know disappeared but then again uh, we're making new videos now in a much more uh, uh, discreet way how, how can we say that we don't share our passwords anymore with uh, with uh, girlfriends and so because they might get jealous in a way and one day they might wipe all your pictures and videos away eh? just because they are jealous okay so now um, we just updated uh, the baby and you can see a brand new boot screen a brand new uh, boot screen Android and this will be the version 2.2 so we will be able to watch YouTube videos finally on this uh, beautiful device I heard uh, one of the makers say that uh, this device was the same as as the home tablet V1 but it just had more memory but then again it also has a other processor eh? so the information was not uh, perfect what this uh, man was saying there so um, you know cause this uh, device use another processor as the uh, as the V1 otherwise I could flash this device with the old version of RK Android the 1.2 but now I needed um, a different version and this is uh, uh, also uh, the flashing tool for I thought uh, for more devices eh? more devices are uh, all the devices with this kind of uh, processor are um, able to be flashed with this tool and as you can see it takes a little long for the startup but uh, you know we just did the installation so this might uh, 
take a little because it still has to fit all the little things lots of programs are installed marketplace is installed and you will be surprised uh, how nice this device will work eh? and for my dutch people for my dutch people als jij uh, als jij dit apparaat ook uh, in je bezit hebt en je denkt van damn wat een wat een dom apparaat ik had er zo weinig mee moet je hem echt even upgraden um, als je deze advertentie via marktplaats uh, hebt gevonden hoe jij je uh, argos 7 een beter apparaat kunt maken uh, don't hesitate geef altijd even een belletje als ik je kan helpen zal ik je helpen maar in principe zou je aan deze video genoeg moeten hebben om jouw apparaat een veel beter apparaat te maken en we're still uh, looking at the green screen and uh, I don't hope that it's uh, stocked but I don't think so we're giving it uh, a couple of more minutes just to see what's gonna happen and in the worst case it won't start up uh, the first time and then we will just hit the reset button at the back and then um, then it should start up eh? for now it's not uh, doing anything as you can see nothing's happening and this is taking uh, pretty long so we might assume that it got stuck you know birdie b and l so i'm not really really sure what's going on here but no problem we take the baby and we see that not, nothing is going on here i think she is stuck we just go at the back we hit the reset button oops couple of seconds we let go of the button and then uh, she should start up now eh? we just hit the reset button one two three four five we turn it on and let's take a let's take a new look what's gonna happen now and we get the same Android screen again and now it should start up eh? I remember the first time flashing you see it's uh, it's it's working now I remember after the first time flashing my V1 I had the same problem the Night Dominion uh, firmware the V3 got stuck at the startup and then nothing happened and now um, I think I have the same problem with uh, the V2 and let's uh, see if she is uh, starting up now eh? and there you go she's uh, started up what we're gonna do now is what we did before we're gonna um, how you call this touch me and let's go to the home screen enter home screen it's entering the home screen at least it should it should and there you go uh, it's saying uh, if your team looks ugly as your team developer to update notice to add remove blah 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 you should read this okay um, I don't think my screen looks ugly I just want to see what's under the engine and as you can see we have some uh, very beautiful programs here and I hope you can read it a little bit here here we have uh, what do we have here APK installer we have uh, audio player wait let me keep it like this for you we have a normal browser as you can see we have market market is here uh, super user sound recording settings let's check out the settings and let's look at what we have here as you can see the screen is very nice responsive and oops back 
as you can see here we have Froyo it's Froyo can you read it and the Android version is 2.21 so this device is updated so let's see if things like YouTube work eh? look the battery is almost empty you should uh, connect her to the um, how you call it you should connect her to the um, adapter when you're doing this because if if you flash her and in the middle of the flashing the thing goes wrong you know you might lose some data so don't do that as you can see the screen also turns nice um, yeah what can I say it looks good I just want to know if I can watch some YouTube videos now let's see if YouTube is uh, included oh wait how do we do that oh you see that this is a different slide that this is not uh, go to the, the go down but this is a different slide let's see if we have some nice backgrounds here let's see what will happen um, wallpapers wow and I see only one one wallpaper I don't see live wallpapers no live wallpapers launcher action widgets what kind of widgets do we have here calendar power tool search security guard of course the first thing we have to install on this thing is advanced task killer so what I'm gonna do we have to uh, perform a hack to let this thing work and I'm gonna show you um, how to do this hack we have to do a hack to uh, let the marketplace work so let's see how we gonna do that hack first we will have to go to arctablet.com the place where we found this um, how you call it this firmware so let's take a look by the way this flashing tool is also for the uh, for the Argos 8 and uh, if you have an Argos 8 and you want to flash this your device you can use this tool Okay, we are uh, at the place where we uh, downloaded this firmware and up here you will see that there is an Android market fix. Can you read that? You see that? We hit the Android market fix. After installing Arc Tools, when you have the market running, if you are missing some applications in the market, for example Google Maps, YouTube, there is a fix that should correct the problem and give you full access to all market applications. Up here you see a little video that will show you what to do. But you can also look at the pictures. Eh? First of all, go to settings. Okay? First of all, go to settings. So, uh, we go, we go to settings. Here we hit settings. You see that? First go to settings and then go to applications. Applications. We hit applications. Then go to manage applications. Go to manage applications. You see that? Then you go to all tabs here. Yeah. And then uh, you go to market application. Yeah. You go down. It's alphabetic so it should be there and you go to the market can you read that the market application and then uh, clear cut shade then four stop settings applications manage applications all tabs can you read that? What we're doing now is the market fixer. So you see you have to first log in with your Google account and now we can say clear catch. Clear catch, you see that? And we say force stop. Okay? And now Google services and framework. Can you read that here? We go up there. And that's important. And up there we hit we hit clear data clear data we hit you see that clear data yes 
and then we hit for stop you see this is the proper way to perform the market hack and then we can go back you know and then we will uh, reboot this device uh, power off okay so after the restart market will run just fine don't forget not uh, because you will see all the programs in market uh, place like 10,000 and more um, not because you see them they will work on your device you know um, there is not it wasn't without uh, a reason why um, why uh, there was no market uh, place on on this on this device because if if uh, Arcus had uh, put in the marketplace you know lots of customers would complain because uh, many programs are not even working with this Arcus 7 so you have this marketplace and you have this 50,000 programs but just a couple will work but the nicest thing is that you will find programs that you know you could not find uh, with with the apps uh, 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 how you call it uh, program of Arcus the one that comes with your device so you know that is a pity uh, to some people but then again to Arcus it's a safe way to give the customers uh, a better feeling about the software that they download because all the software that you will download with AppSlip uh, will work on your Arcus you know because they were they were like made for the Arcus and and all these other programs on marketplace are not specific made for the Arcus you just have uh, access to all these programs but it doesn't mean that they also work so don't go hating on Argos on on marketplace if something doesn't work just try another program now after the reboot I will go to marketplace and get advanced task killer that will be my first program to download and then I will download tune in radio tune in radio and tune in radio is a very nice station and for my Suriname people my Suriname people um, as you tune in radio download dan kan je dus ook naar alle Surinaamse zenders in één keer je hebt ze allemaal in één overzicht en je kan gewoon intunen hè? je kan naar Apinti luisteren Boskopu SRS ABC al die stationen kan je gewoon lekker beluisteren en het is echt chillen vooral als je gewoon ergens met iets bezig bent en je luistert naar je radio Apinti enige vervelende vind ik die overlijdensberichten en ze duren nog steeds net zo lang als 30 jaar geleden respect voor Apinti, respect voor al die radiostations Radio 10, mijn brothers Elias daar zo, je weet, respect YouTube let's see if we can install YouTube YouTube install oké okay. your item will be downloaded and up here on top you can see that it's downloading it you can also pull this down I think YouTube installing you see it will install automatically so successfully installed um, okay let's how do we go to the home button home okay let's see if our YouTube is working because it's all about YouTube eh? it's all about YouTube we love YouTube YouTube is very very nice so we accept we fully accept and we are guilty we are guilty of liking YouTube so we just hit one stupid video rotate or double tap the video for full screen and there you go YouTube is working just fine now you see that so I'm not kidding you your device can now play YouTube videos the way it should oh man good quality eh 
I like. We need. We need advanced. Advanced task killer. It will show. Advanced task killer. This is what you need. It's free. Okay, install. Okay. And now we will search for tune in radio. We hit install. Okay. There we go. Tune in radio will be installed. Omroep NL. Okay, what is that? That's what I was looking for. I think we can watch television with this. The item will be download the Dutch newspapers. Also installing. Okay. You see that? I'm showing you some 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 easy things that you could also uh, do eh? if you're from Holland. Just want to go all the way down. Trains. You can see the train times. There's so much rubbish you can download. Marketplace to buy the cheapest things here in Holland. Ramawar weather weather forecast. Um, radio tips. Sterren.nl. Oh yes, one more little thing. This really rocks. This is to put in your Arcus. You see that? And now your Arcus will be much more protected. You see? And you can put it to stand on the table and flip it and just put it in your pocket. So you should get one of these. This will protect your Arcus. Anyway, now you know how to update your V2 the Arca 7 V2, a wonderful tablet and one that is pretty strong also the quality and you should uh, update it to make it a better device. You see how I did it uh, and I'm sure you can also do it. And for my Dutch people, ga dit lekker doen and make your device a better than it ooit is geweest. Thank you for watching, this was Puck Darlington and we say from a rainy Holland uh, till the next video. Bye now. Thank you.